Hello and welcome to Roaster Plays the Dark Souls 3 uh, DLC expansion. So, if uh, any of you watched my uh, my mic sound test uh, video, I fought and failed to kill uh, Soul of Cinder, but this um, I already killed him off off camera, and now we are now in the post game sequence. Um, just for context, we are in New Game Plus Plus Plus. Uh, I am level 140. Yeah, I have uh, hit the uh, life stats at 40, vitality is 30, and I'm running a quality build with strength and dex at 40. Now, I have a lot of uh, hail tongues and slabs, so if I find any good weapons in DLC, I might switch up my build and rock that weapon. Okay, um, context with the DLC. I have once reached uh, the church area in the first DLC, and I have watched a Let's Play, so I kind of know what to expect. However, with the Ring City, I have no idea what's there. I've heard of Gale. I know that he's being compared to Artorias, but that's it. I've seen no footage of the Ring DLC. And um, yeah, we're gonna be rocking the uh, Black Knight Halberd just for now. Uh, uh, the Great Axe, sorry, I mean. And uh, I'll check and I'll see if I have... Uh, well, if I don't feel like using that, I might switch to the Profane Great Swords. And if I need some speed, I'll switch to Onikiri Ubadachi. And I got some Carcass Rouges, you know, just in case I need some bleeding on the katanas. Uh, for now, before we head into the DLC, let's uh, I want to talk to Yuria first, since you know um, both DLCs are kind of attached to Londor. Our Lord and Liege, thine heart is fixed upon the linking of the fires, but brave you suffer, I prithee. Oh, come on, I, ar I already wrestled the flame. Must be something else. Ah, she has nothing new. Never mind. I thought she had something new to say, you know, um, when you were done making the flame. Uh, stealing the flame, I mean. Because I went for the, uh, the Lord of Londor ending, where you wrestle and uh, take the, uh, the first flame and put it into your own body. Uh, are we missing anything else here? I don't think so. Alright, let's do this. Let's start off the first DLC. Watch me get body. Uh, no? Where is it again? Yeah, Cleansing Chapel. This is gonna suck. I'm doing the DLC in NG++. I wanted to do a fresh save, but then I thought I do not want to play uh, the base game of Dark Souls for the 6th or 7th time. Okay, oh man, what's up? You wanna... You wanna try Tongue Butthole? A. A. What do that? Sha! Nah, it doesn't look that good. Maybe this one. Maybe this one works. Yeah! Nah, doesn't work. Alright. What you got for me, bud? Hold. Is. Hold the same scent as that woman. I swear I did not wear woman's cologne. An action oh. <laughs> you must read it. Well, I am, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm rocking the uh, Fire Link uh, set because it looks dope. You sound like my friend who moans a lot. I'm not saying who. Don't mind me, didn't mean to fall apart. <laughs> now, fashion-wise, I have a kindness to ask of you. 
what you got for me, bro? Well, maybe you're just in the cold mind of Adam and Eve. Mm -hmm. I need you to show her flame. Hey, is that uh, a... Flame oh, will burn I thought... I thought flame meant dick. If you truly are Adam, because sex joke. Then it must be fire that you seek. Yeah, sure. I mean, I already have flame in me. And if you can see my cape, it's burning! But, yeah, it's whatever. Oh, thank you. For the past, no regrets. Except, you know, Ash and ones are kind of seen as, uh, you know, on Kindle they're seen as the skull of the earth. Yeah, bro, come on. Hey, man, don't you touch my thing. Touch my thing. Ooh. Yeah, that is the weirdest start to any DLC ever. And you die. I'm so gonna get bodied in this DLC. Cause I played it on on a, new, on a normal new game. I started a fresh character before, I reached the first part of the first DLC, and it was fucking tough. So I am not looking forward to, uh, you know, seeing the new game plus 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 enemies. But hey, this is my decision. This is what I thought was smart, and I never saw you before. Who the fuck are you? I never saw you before. Uh, huh? uh, have you just arrived? How very unusual. Am I that dumb and blind that I just didn't see him the first time I came here? For this is a true haven of the forlorn. The forlorn. The cold and gentle painted world of Arendelle. Mm -hmm. Go along. So yeah, Ashes of Ariandel is happening in the uh, painted world of Ariandel. Obviously, either a reference or a direct link to uh, Dark Souls One's the painted world of Ariane. Ah, ah, yes, of course. You're no exception. We've all seen terrible things. I'm seeing one right now. You're safe now. Let it ease your burden. Ariandel will make a Fine home for you. Nah, bitch, I'm a wreck this place. Fine home for yourself. I'm a wreck this place. A sweetly rotting bed to lie upon. Can I take your bed? Quietly. Go along. Find my Wow, place. this guy has a lot of dialogue. A sweetly rotting bed to lie upon. Is that it? Quietly. Yeah, that's a it. Okay. Let's take this item. And blue moss pump. That's for freezing, right? Whatever. Let's explore to the painted world of Ariando. And we got a bonfire. Thank you. Let's set it that. And yeah. Okay. DLC Stoppo. Who is this? Akaime. No, not from me. Just want to check your name. Akaime. And yeah, I am not. Well, I have played this, yes, but I'm not, you know, that familiar with it. I don't memorize it just like I do the base game, but I do know that these bitches are going to attack you, so I'm going to take you down first. No! What the fuck? And, uh, God, I already aggroed someone. I'm being, I'm being invaded. I am going to play this section as, you know, I'm just going to keep playing until I die and redo this section, not kin, not kin, unkindled, because fuck doing this kindled, man. It's 
my first actual proper playthrough, and I'm gonna do it being invaded? No, fuck you. Fuck you. Where is it coming? Where is it coming from? Come on, man. Just, 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 just finish the charade. Oh god, this, this axe, man. This axe is so good. Ah, oh, there he is, motherfucker. This motherfucker is trying to bait me to those pots. Piece of shit. Ah, uh, motherfucker. I'm just not gonna heal. I don't care if this guy kills me. Ah, oh, motherfucker! Animal! I can't believe I didn't die. I mean, I'll admit, there was some lag, lag advantage on my part, but still, I did not care about that fight at all, and I still won, so fuck you, one piece. And that sounds like my friend, Laurelius. Fuck that guy. Did you know that he still hasn't finished Dark Souls 3, even though he's had my copy for months? What a scrub. I'm sorry, Lawrence, that's a joke. Well, it's true, but it's still a joke. Ah, fuck. Ooh, man, this axe. This axe is a beauty. I'm not usually uh, that keen on axes in Dark Souls games, but this axe, man. This axe is a beast. But I suck. And I'm not using it properly. I'll take you out first because you are a bitch. Yep, that's it. Maybe this guy first. No, this guy first because he's breathing fire and he has no shield. Huh, that worked out well. Nice. Fuck you. Fuck you. And we shall move on. Is this... Nope. When do they start coming alive? I know that they're gonna come alive. I know, and this is the part that... Yep, this is it. So yeah, like I said, I've played up to the church area before, so I kind of know what to expect. Sorry if this isn't what you guys expected, you know, oh, I'm lost. Nah, I'm an experienced Dark Souls player. Watch me get bodied as I say that. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm an experienced Dark Souls player, and then dead, right? That's what everyone wants. Retribution. Okay, I kind of forgot how many wolves there are in this area. I remember playing this on my first try with the Onikiri and Ubuda. There we go! The, there, there's, there's the trees. Do they come alive when the wolves appear? I, fuck, I forgot how long the tracking is. These fireballs hold like a bitch. Ah, uh, yeah. Is this it? Is this where I get bodied right after saying I'm an experienced Dark Souls player? I think this is it. Yeah. When did those trees come alive? Was it in conjunction with the, uh, with the wolves? I think so. Anyway. Oh, they are tough. They are tough. Yeah, 
and kill him fast. Three swings. That, that that's a lot. That is a lot. I'm gonna use a strong attack instead. Much faster. Nope, not faster. And here we go. Fuck me. Run away. Nigger in the yo. I need to heal. I need to heal. I'm just gonna run past these trees, see if there's anything uh anything worth behind them. Ah, more wolves! Yes, that is exactly what I needed. There's an item there. Alright. Fuck this area. Okay guys, I want to talk about trees. Trees are a bitch. You know why I love paper so much? Because paper is just dead trees. Look at that. Look at that. They want to grab you, they want to spit ice on you, and they want to throw fire on you. Fuck trees, man. Is this where the next bonfire is? Okay, I vaguely remember there being a bonfire here, but I also remember coming in from the opposite side. As in, I came from here, and I reached that spot. Whatever. I'm gonna I'm gonna double back and go through the other way anyway. So let's just keep exploring. Is this a path? Yes it is. No it's not. We have that funnel solved. Oh shit! Oh, there it is. There's a bonfire. Okay, so does this mean that I can go through the entire zone in two ways? Because I have never done this before. Last time I went through the other path, and you double, you double back and go through this area from the left side instead of the right. Oh no, because this is closed off. Uh, I mean, this is a cliff going up and I can't go up. Because if you go through the other side, you jump down from there and that's how you find this spot. But you can also just go left past the trees and past the wolves and just go to the house directly. That's good to know. So, okay. I'll uh I'll do the other side first before going inside the house. Because that's my reference point for, you know, not knowing what's gonna go ahead. Uh, not not knowing what's gonna happen uh, ahead. Because that's where I stop. Let's double back and go to the other side first. Oh yeah, these loading screens are gonna be quiet because I'm trying to juggle a lot of things. I'm making sure the recording is on and scratching my ass. So yeah, I'll try to talk during the loading screen. Oh, who? Who? Is it that guy? I think it's just this guy. Sir, are you talking all the way from in here, sir? Sir? He has nothing to do for me. It's kind of sad, you know, talking by yourself while I'm kind of playing a game over here. Talking to myself. Are these guys going to chase me? I'm just going to run. I'm just going to run. Because you guys don't want to see me fight them again, don't you? Do they chase you? No, they don't. Yes, they do, but they can't jump down. Aha! Screwed with your padding, didn't I, fuckers? 
Okay, yeah, just deal with these wolves. I know there's something up here, but let's deal with these wolves first. Ah, god damn it. Okay, I think I need to switch to a faster weapon for these wolves. Because this is. Oh, oh, never mind. It's working out. It's working out. That, however, did not. And I'm out of stamina. Oh, hey, look at that. First death of the DLC. By a wolf attack. Huh, so we were right. I did get bodied by the wolves. Just not immediately. But by the wolves nonetheless. So, yeah. Take that off on your bingo card. Anyway, so we've established that uh, these knights, warriors, I don't know, these, these undead, these hollows don't follow you, so you just line to this area. The wolves, however, I think we should switch. Let's put on the uh, Owen Yu. I call it the Owen Yu. That edge! No, because Onikiri no Budachi is just a mouthful. Huh, it takes two attacks. It might not be faster, actually. But, we'll see. I'll try and use the one-handed attacks. Yeah, that's faster. Yeah, this is this is the way to go. I get the wolves. Can I equip both the axe and Owen Yu? I might have to switch... Uh, I might have to switch the Ring of Iron Protection for a Hazel String if I want to do that. Which I'm not sure if I want to do that because damage is high in this DLC. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look at me. Look at me. Look at this scrub. Look at this scrub spamming R1. And not even, not even paying attention to what he's swinging at. And I got spotted again! Hey! Fuck me. That's right. To the people who know me in real life, this is the guy who keeps saying, Yeah, Dark Souls is amazing. You should try it. Get good scrub. And I got bodied by wolves twice. But yeah, at least I know that the Onikiri and Ubudachi works well. I just need to, you know, use it well. And not swing blindly. Stupid fuck I am. And maybe not getting cornered is a good strategy. Don't call your friends. We don't need your friends. Okay, I know exactly what's gonna come next, so I wanna deal with all these uh these wolf reinforcements first. Yeah, this is much better now that I'm actually paying attention to what I'm hitting. This is the last one. <laughs> I say last as if he is the last one. Wow, there, there's more. How, how many is that now? These are, these are the fourth uh, groups of three, so there's now, there's 12 wolves, I think. Oh yeah, just for context, we do not need souls anymore, so I do not care about going back to this one. Yes, I can. I can equip both the axe and Onikiri Ubadachi. So, just at the 69%. Uh, threshold, perfect, perfect. And I know these trees are gonna come to life, so I'm gonna just gonna deal with them immediately. What about you, bitch? What about you? Yep. Fuck you. Obviously, you too. Fuck you. 
Maybe I should try uh, one light and one heavy. Oh god, these guys, I forgot. There's four of them. Look at these. Look at this DLC with this rave party. This group gangbang, one after the other. And they're just gonna throw their ranged attacks at me, aren't they? Yes, they are. So, I should go in! And I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. Oh wow, those javelin throws are far. I wanna go for this guy first because he's a problem. Yep, that's dealt with. Now, yeah, I'll do this now because I'm not gonna come back to this spot. I think. I'll just see what's on top. Probably gonna be an item. Yep, okay. This axe, y'all. This axe is a beast. Any trees? Nope, no trees. Follower javelin! Okay, let's try that out. Let's just try out the new weapons as they come. Standard spear moveset. The javelin itself is kinda short, so. Yeah, standard spear thrust, uh, two hand, standard two hand, uh, what's the weapon art? Yeah, the weapon art is a javelin thrust, okay. Keep going for a bit. Oh, I know exactly what's gonna, gonna happen next. Follow up on the on the wolf motif. Look at that! Look at that motherfucker right there, just, just waiting to pounce on us. Oh shit! I forgot. He has wolf buddies. He has wolf buddies. Oh shit! I have to deal with this one last wolf buddy first. Oh god damn it, where's the last one? Yep, look at that. Look at that Sif wannabe. You're not Sif. You're not Sif. But you are hella strong. So I'm just gonna shut up and take you seriously. Okay, I might be better off being fast, so I'm gonna bring it up a little long. Oh! Oh, that's right, you don't... You don't get to actually kill him all the way. So, hm, that worked out fine. 